peace and love. It's Auntie Oni, and I'm going to read you another Zug classic. It's called The Jungle Book. Deep in the Indian jungle, a baby named Mowgli was lost and alone. His parents brought him into the jungle when the village was attacked by a tiger. Mowgli was found by a caring panther named Bagheera. Bagheera brought Mowgli to a pack of wolves, asking that they raise him as their own man cub. Akila, the brave leader of the pack, agreed. Mowgli grew up playing with his wolf brothers and sisters. He even became friends with a silly bear named Baloo, who taught him the laws of the jungle. Baloo showed Mowgli how to gather honey, swim in the river, and choose fruit that were safe to eat. Though the jungle could be dangerous sometimes, Mowgli felt happy and safe with his wild family. Let's keep reading about Mowgli's adventures in the jungle. Mowgli learned how to be courageous and how to respect all the animals in the jungle. Until one day, he wandered away from the wolf pack and met Shere Khan, a mean, angry tiger who did not like man cubs. He threatened to harm Mowgli and his wolf pack. Prowling around with menacing eyes, Mowgli ran back to Baloo and Bagheera, who told them that a red flower from the nearby man village would scare Shere Khan away forever. Mowgli was sad to leave his jungle home, but knew he had to protect his family. He journeyed to the man village where he made new friends and learned about the human ways. Do you think Mowgli will find the red flower in the man village? What do you think the red flower is? Mowgli discovered that the red flower was actually called fire. It was warm and bright, but it hurt to touch it. He learned how to light a fire by rubbing two sticks together. Mowgli soon returned proudly to the jungle, ready to face Shere Khan with his new skill. Mowgli came face to face with the tiger and quickly started a fire and a big tree branch. Seeing the fire, Shere Khan got scared. (gasps) He'd never seen something so bright and hot before. (gasps) The tiger growled, but Mowgli waved the small flame, making it bigger and brighter. (gasps) Shere Khan was so frightened, he ran off into the dark jungle. Never to be seen again. Mowgli, Baloo, Bagheera, and the wolves were finally safe. They all danced together under the stars, celebrating Mowgli's victory. Oh, wasn't that a good story? Yes, I love it. Keep listening to Zug Stories for more great telling of classic folk tales right here on Zug.